Hello everyone. In this video tutorial we will show you how CAD nesting true shape works, TPA software to nest irregular shapes, or shapes with holes inside them. When we open TPA CAD, let's enable first in the upper left corner the nesting interface. Now we are using the CAD nesting interface, available in two versions, square, for the rectangular shapes, and true shape, for irregular shapes. In the list menu bottom right, there are several icons to import different kinds of files or lists. The software can add to the list files in TCN format, DXF format or lists in a text format. Let's add now four irregular pieces in TCN format, to which we add eight DXFs, thus creating a mixed file list. To speed it up, we assign by default 12 repetitions to each a work piece, and then we change the quantities different from 12 on the individual rows. In the rotation column, let's enable the any rotation parameter on the whole list, allowing the nesting to turn the shapes freely. Let's nest now the first pieces. As you can see as a first result, we have used five plates of two different types from the material store, one called melanin. and one generic, the materials can be assigned in the list, if they are not given, the software automatically assigns them, based on their thickness. Let's save the results now. The saving procedure also generates the labels that can now be displayed for each selected piece. Finally, let's save the nesting report in a PDF file, so you can store or print a summary with all relevant information. This report also includes a thumbnail of all the plates with their placements. At this stage, let's open the TCN file saved for each plate by TPA CAD. As you can see, the file contains all the information needed by your machine equipped with TPA nesting system. I hope that this video helped you. Please, look up our YouTube channel or our Facebook page for further videos tutorials of TPA software or more applications.